Y'all wanna see my neighbor? DJ, say hey. <laughs> Y'all wanna know who be making all the fucking noise in my YouTube videos? It be him. Look at him. Look at his ass. Just guilty. Yep. Fuck it. <laughs> I feel like it's do or die, she give her soul to me She wanna be close to me, oh She say she fuck with me the long way She say she gon' run my back, I had a long day She said, baby, I ain't gon' lead you down the wrong way Okay, <clears throat> now y'all done met my ghetto-ass neighbor But I let him know It's my nigga, baby, all day Try me if you want to and watch he don't play Hey, come on, bar shit Damn, I'm out here I'm a whole rapper um, fuck that blue hunnids nigga. If I don't know, it's a, it's an insider. I don't know what order I'm posting my videos in because I did two reaction videos at home. Damn, I feel like these motherfuckers ain't gonna let me turn it. I'm gonna hate every bit of it. Hold on, I'm gonna have to do some savagery, some, some road sorcery real quick, but not too bad though because y'all already know Houston drivers don't play that shit. So I got to be careful about what the fuck I do. <clears throat> Definitely already posted that video. That crazy ass lady shooting and shit. Oh, they turned from the wrong way, didn't it? See? See what I'm saying? Y'all can learn. Um, but y'all, baby, when I tell you I'm a fresh 30, I am a fresh 30. And I literally I make videos about peace all the time. I need a fucking refill. I make videos about peace all the time. Cause I just be trying to hold mine. I just be trying to hold mine. I be trying to act right like I got some saints, like I was raised correctly. And going into this new decade, I just really, I've grown so much. Like if y'all would have knew me back then, baby, from twerking to fucking to cussing people out, going to jail, fighting, just all kinds of shit. I was bad. I was tearing shit up, punching holes in the wall, breaking phones, TVs, anything I can get my hands on. Like, I was so bad. I was so bad. I was horrible. But the amount of growth, like, I was journaling and I just be looking back like, damn, bro. Like, you really done came a long way. Like, you definitely 30 now. <laughs> like you definitely 30 nigga you went from hoeing on the streets to helping kids and writing books i'm so fucking proud of your ass but i definitely claim this to be the year of me and i just when i say the year of me it's because i have been in such toxicity for the last two years like since 2020 toxic relationships toxic friendships toxic just everything just toxic as hell Stress the fuck out. Look at my face. Look at my face. My hands be all fucked up and shit. It's just too much stress happening in my life. And I was like, you know what? Nah, -uh, not today. Say no. You will not mess with my aura. We gotta start taking our aura more seriously. Like we have to start taking our peace and positivity way more seriously. Like, me and Christian was joking about fasting, like, from people and shit, but no bullshit, that's actually a thing. That's actually a thing that I'm definitely about to implement. I'm finna start fasting from people. Like, certain people, like, you know how you can only take people in doses? Like, I'm definitely finna start fasting from people. I'm not peopling. <laughs> like, I'm, I don't want to people. I don't want to people today. I don't want to people at all, because me and humans just don't really get along like that. But... Yeah, you got to start fasting. You got to start protecting your space. You got to... Nigga, really? I'm not finna play with y'all on this road today. Now, I got folks watching. So, just in case some of y'all want to do something stupid, I'm going to hit that upload button so motherfucking me fast. It's going to be a problem. Damn. Y'all in a rush to get there? It's traffic. Ain't nobody going nowhere. Um, 
Let me forget my train of thought. No, damn well, I can't do two things at one time. What was I finna say? Shit, I done forgot. Hold on, let me think about it. You should think about it. Take a second. Matter of fact, you know what? I'm childish as hell is what the problem is. I might be 30, but I'm still childish. I'm 30 in number in years, right? I got the soul of a 50-something-year-old, probably 60-something, but I'm childish like a fucking teenager. Like, it's, I, it's so many mixes in me at once. But, oh, I was talking about the year of me. The fact that my name is Miranda Evans just works so wonderful. So, the year of me is basically like, I spend so much of my time, life, effort, energy, putting it into other people, dealing with people's shit, just, it, everything is about everybody except me, and I don't like that, I don't like that, somewhere along the way, I lost myself, because I look at, like, if you go all the way back, right, to my YouTube videos from, let's say, like, three, five years ago, like, go all the way back, you can see the passion and fire that I had then, compared to now, it's like, I still got that same fire, but it, it, it just don't, it don't, it hit different, like, it ain't, I can't feel it, like, I feel it back then, and I was like, somewhere along the way, I lost who I was, is this the ambulance, is this the ambulance is coming, that is the ambulance is coming, and you are about to turn into this gas station, okay, Alrighty. okay, they on that side, so what we doing? What we doing? Somewhere along the way, I lost who I was. Especially, especially being in a relationship, like a toxic one at that, which I have already said that was a toxic relationship. That ain't news. I lost literally who I was. Like, I started doing shit that, that wasn't even me. Like, it just wasn't who I was. Like, it was some old Miranda shit, like teenage Miranda shit. Because from 21 all the way up until, um, or we'll go years, 2013 all the way up until 2020, I was single. So it was just me. All I had was me. Like, I did some dating here and there, but it was nothing serious. So those were the years of me. That's how I got to where I am because it was just me and I was so focus-driven. I ain't have no distractions. I ain't have no obligations other than my work. I was just... I'm talking about fire, just like on target, unstoppable, ambitious like a motherfucker. Like, I, I'm still that person. I just don't have the same fire that I used to. And then, too, I'm getting older, so I ain't got the much energy as I used to. But somewhere along the way, I lost that, and I kept trying to find it. I spent years, like, I spent the past few years trying to get back to that person but I realized the only way to get back to that person is to be by myself again and that's where the issue came in like in order for this to be the year of you you gotta be with just you like everybody else can't you can't be fuck it like in toxic ass relationships friendships family ships none of that shit like you got to cut all that shit off and that is exactly what the fuck I am going to do I am cutting all of that shit off. I don't want no parts of it. I don't want no parts of it. I really want to go check this off as well. <sighs> yeah, I don't want no parts of it. You really just have, I, Miranda, and I'm talking to myself, but I'm talking to y'all too. You got to be by yourself in order to become yourself. Can, what? Bitch, did you just say that and did? You have to be by yourself in order to become yourself. If you really want to know who you are and you really want to love yourself, then you have to be willing to be by yourself. Hold the fuck up. You said that we got an issue? <clears throat> Baby, listen. When I tell you, if we got a motherfucking issue, sorry y'all, it's, it's, it's some things going on in my life that I can't speak about right now, um, but nevertheless, I'm not worried, <coughs> and um, he better not come outside while I'm sitting here trying to finish my vlog, but 
um, make sure you focus on you. Like, that's what I want to do. I don't want nobody fucking with my aura, fucking with my peace, none of that. That nigga got a camera right there, too. Is that even his room? Really, DJ? This one? You know what? I ain't gonna ask no questions. Because them hoes keep me safe, too. So, fuck it. Um, this has to be the year of you. The moment of you, the year of you. It's the year of me. I don't like people fucking with my aura. I don't like it. I don't, I don't like it. Okay, I don't like it. <laughs> it. It bothers me when people come with that toxic shit. No, no, no. I don't have the patience, okay? If we, look, either we gonna let this shit go, we gonna fight. It ain't but two options. I don't do the back and forward. I'm not finna do all that. And I'm trying not to fight as much because I'm too goddamn old to be out here fighting. Now, I don't wanna have to do that unless it's absolutely the fuck necessary. I will always and forever get into some gangster shit just because, for one, that is the type of families that I come from. For two, niggas really be trying you. Niggas be trying you for sure. Like, I be chilling. I don't fool, I don't mess with nobody. I don't play with nobody. Like, I just be minding my business. I'm really the sweetest person in the world. I'm sarcastic as hell. I ain't got no filter, so I will say some fucked up shit. But at the end of the day, I really am a cool-ass person. First of all, I'm a Virgo. Virgos get along with everybody. Virgos don't be beefing and shit. We don't we don't do that. We earth signs. We get along with everybody. We are like the center of all the signs. Like I've never met a sign I didn't get along with. Never. I was thinking about that shit the other day. I've never met a sign I didn't get along with. But I just don't I always if somebody is messing with my aura, baby, you're gonna have to get blocked, deleted removed all that now for the trolls that's on my fucking youtube y'all i'm sarcastic as hell okay i am sarcastic as hell y'all look comments uh, they don't get to me they don't piss me off i be laughing like a motherfucker that should be so funny what do i always say in my videos that's how you can tell who know me for real and who don't because i always say opinions are like assholes everybody has one lord have mercy but hold my peace lord <laughs> it's basically what i'm trying to say hold my peace and i'm telling you the same thing hold your peace because motherfuckers is gonna try you the devil is gonna try you and he may win in that moment but don't let him hold you too long. Do not let him hold you too long. Like the shit that just happened with me over the past few days had me hotter than motherfucking fish grease at a motherfucking cookout. I was mad. I was stressed. I was unhappy. It was fucking with my aura and I didn't like it. And by the end of the day yesterday, about halfway through, I was like, you know what? Man, fuck that shit. Like, my level of giving fuck just went all the way down. I was like, I'm not finna let this shit fuck with my peace. I ain't got time for this. I got other shit to be doing. I don't have time for this. And that, that was it. You just literally have to tell yourself, you know what? Fuck it. I don't have time for this. You fucking with my aura. I don't like it. Therefore, I can't fuck with you. You fucking with my peace. Don't do that. Don't do that. You got to go. <laughs> you got to go. I don't give a damn if your mama, your daddy, your cousin, your sister, your brother, your ex... Your, your husband, your wife, your boy, boyfriend, your girlfriend. I don't give a damn. If you can work it out, work it out. Because I know husbands and marriages, that shit different. But if you can work it out, then do that. But if it's toxic, get rid of it and get rid of him or her. Even if it's just temporary, just exit out. Move it along. Cut them alerts off. If you got to do like the old school petty ass shit where you change a nigga name and your number, the bitch don't text back. Don't be lying. Y'all do that shit. Y'all do that shit. If you got to change the name in the phone to nigga fuck you, you fucking weird ass bitch. I don't give a fuck. Like, do whatever you have to do to stay away from that toxic ass shit. Okay? Whatever method works for you. Get thee behind me. I say so much shit. Like, I got so many sayings. I got hold my peace. You can't fuck on my aura. Get thee behind me. I got so many sayings. Like, you literally have to come up with sayings and mantras and shit just to remind yourself and say them out loud just so you can tell yourself, you know what? Not today, Satan. Not today. I'm not finna let you fuck with my peace today. 
Because the only thing I'm going to focus on is today. We worry about tomorrow when it get here. And yesterday gone, so I can't do nothing about that. That's pretty much all I got to say. Um, I got to get back in here and finish recording videos and shit. So, and get ready for this live I'm about to do. Again, I don't know what order my videos be posted in. I just be kind of posting them hoes. So, you'll see this when you see this. Okay? Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hmm. Why don't you do that? Why don't you take a moment? Okay, moment up. You should have hit the button already. But I love y'all. And until the next video, bye.